Using the project tool, you can quickly project a 2D object or NURBS curve onto a NURBS surface. This is useful for creating irregular, non-linear shapes by trimming or splitting the NURBS surface or cutting holes in it. To use the project tool, select it from your 3D modeling tool set. You will see three modes in the toolbar. These will allow you to split, trim, or add your projected shape to the NURB surface. To use the first mode, split mode, you will first need to draw the splitting object. In your desired view, draw a 2D object or NURBS curve. This will be the shape that is used to split the NURBS surface that the shape is projected onto. In your current view, make sure the object intersects the NURBS surface that you are going to split. The view is important here as the splitting object geometry will be projected based on your view or the object's location on the screen, not the location of the object in 3D space. If you want to project the object onto a surface based on its physical location, you can group the 2D shape or NURBS curve and use the group with the project tool. If you draw an open 2D object or NURBS curve, both endpoints must be outside the NURBS surface. Once you have your shape, click on the project tool from the 3D modeling toolset and choose split mode from the toolbar. Now click on the splitting object. You will see it highlighted in red. Then click on the NURBS surface you wish to split. The splitting object is projected and the surface is split where the two objects intersect. This will create a group with the resulting surfaces. Ungroup the group in order to select each new surface. The second mode of the project tool, Trim mode, allows you to trim the NURBS surface using the 2D shape or curve. Like the split mode, you will first need to draw your 2D object or NURBS curve on top of the NURBS surface. Click on the project tool and choose Trim mode. Click once on the trimming object, then click on the surface. The cursor will now change to a pointing hand. Finally, click on the side of the surface to be trimmed. The trimming object is projected onto the NURBS surface and the region selected to be trimmed away is removed from the NURBS surface at the point of intersection, resulting in a new surface or group of NURBS surfaces. You can also add a projection to a surface by using Add Mode, which is the third mode in the toolbar. Like the other modes, Add Mode requires a 2D shape or NURBS curve. However, the shape you are using must be a closed shape in order to add the projection to the surface. Click on Add Mode and then click on the projection shape. Choose the appropriate direction from the toolbar. Add Upward Mode will add the projection in the profile's normal direction. The normal direction is indicated by the red arrow that appears when the shape is selected. Add Downward will add the projection in the opposite direction of the profile plane normal. Add Both Directions mode will add the projection to the surface in the normal direction in the opposite direction. Keep in mind that the projection direction must eventually intersect the surface, or no projection will be created. After clicking on the surface, the object's projection is added to the surface as a generic solid. As you can see, the project tool gives you the ability to create complex shapes that would otherwise be difficult and time-consuming.